Well, the heat doesn't seem like it wants to let up, so we're going to head on over to Robert, who has uh, been, you know, very kindly talking about the wonderful, wonderful yes, weather that so, we're facing. Yes, so jovial. You're, you're like the sunshine in the forecast. Yes, <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> but we could, we could see it maybe cool off by the end of the yeah, week. Yeah, we're right? watching a cold front. A very weak cold front that might come through for this weekend to cool us down back toward average numbers out there. But we'll take a live look outside to Fayetteville right now. You can see old main lit up there in the distance in Fayetteville. Today was an average day, literally by the book, right at 90, right where you should be. <clears throat> but it's that humidity that made it feel like it was close to, if not right above 100 degrees, probably close to that record set in 1969 of 102 uh, Fort Smith this evening. 93 you got up to so two degrees below average but again that that humidity the heat and the humidity really makes things feel like it is just absolutely oppressive out there and that's the way it's going to feel tomorrow which is why we have slapped an impact day onto tomorrow for that dangerously hot weather that we'll see heat indices as high as 110 115 maybe even a few degrees warmer than that so you got to take real precautions for heat stroke and heat exhaustion, whether you're walking your pet, maybe you've got a tennis match or a golf game played, you just have to make sure you keep yourself safe in this heat. We do have a heat advisory in effect. This goes into effect tomorrow at noon through eight o'clock in the evening for not just our Northwest Arkansas counties, but into the River Valley as well. It will be hot everywhere tomorrow. There's really no way to beat around that bush. Temperatures right now mostly in the lower to mid 80s. Dew points absolutely oppressive in the lower to mid 70s. That is rainforest like dew points. And yes, it still feels like it's in the 90s in a few locations at 1021 at night. Under this heat dome right now, as we go into tomorrow, it's really not going to move much. In fact, kind of shift right over our area. So the hot weather sticking around. Heat index values by the time you head home tomorrow afternoon in the teens. Uh, above 100 degrees and then even Wednesday afternoon back about the same thing. Just absolutely miserable conditions out there. Lows tonight mostly in the lower to mid or mid to upper 70s and then mid to upper 90s for our highs tomorrow. And those warm temperatures stick around for a good part of the upcoming week. Then we'll watch if that front can trigger a couple of showers, maybe a thunderstorm as we get into the weekend with temperatures coming down here as we go into the weekend. Same thing for the River Valley, 100 degrees Wednesday and Thursday. Wouldn't surprise me if we also hit 100 Tuesday and or Friday, but we'll just see and have to wait what happens there. So just keep yourself safe if you're headed out, folks. Stay with us. Jordan Black has all your sports news after a word from our sponsors.